Hey everyone, this is Spike Info, and in this video, I'm going to talk about the SQL map tool which is used for SQL injection. So, this is a basic introductory video in which I'm going to access the content of database of a vulnerable website and we're going to uh, like uh, explore the database, like what is the uh, passwords and usernames, uh, authenticate, authenticated usernames and passwords to that websites. Okay, so this is just an introductory. Uh, video you can uh, if you want more in-depth knowledge about in SQL injection SQL map and from other like for for other tools and domain of the cybersecurity then you can comment me below I will surely make videos about it so let's start first I will update my system by the simple command sudo sudo apt update in this I am using the parrot which is an Debian distribution of Linux at the same end, I will just open the Firefox and I will show you the vulnerable website first. Okay, so the website I'm going to hack is uh, it's basically a vulnerable website available for foreign testing purpose. Okay, so this is the website. I will paste the URL in the description so in this first we have to check that uh, which part of a website is vulnerable okay so for that uh, what i will do is i will just uh, surf over the website and let's see which part is vulnerable okay this is the login page okay and here you can see the option of your profile so let's see what's in the category section so there are different categories here let's see for the posters what are there okay so there are different poster and here you can see the url so let's change the number of this cat and yes the numbers are changing so we can use this url or any other url which is changing the content so we can like uh, go into the database part okay so let's go to our uh, terminal I will just zoom it little bit so you can see it hope it is visible I will also open one another terminal ok so here what I will do is I will just type the SQL map help uh, section so here you can see all the commands available for the SQL map okay so what what we going to do is we just going to use the database part so you can see there are lots of section we just going to use the database part database part and all okay so what is the URL so first we have to use so first for starting the SQL map we have to type SQL map then hyphen u u is u determines the URL and that's just paste the URL and here what you want is dbms and just that is database so just type dbs okay so now it has scanned the just the, done the rough scan here and you can find it has like given the two database database which is available uh, of that website okay so what we will do we can just go into information schema or the table uh, database so i will go with this uh, database name aq aqart or something it is so for this now database we have got right so we have right uh, so we have to like give command here sql map u and the url and then hyphen capital d capital d indicates the database to enumerate so we have find the database name which is an accurate Acuart, right? Acuart. Sorry, my bad. And to find the table name, so we will give hyphen hyphen tables. Okay, so it has given the tables which are available in that database. Okay, so there are different different tables uh, in the website. I guess, uh, yeah. So we are uh, browsing the like artistic. Uh, uh, table and we are getting no we are uh, browsing the pictures table and we are getting the pictures right mm, it's product I guess yeah so we are 
browsing the product table and where it is. So now what we will do, I will just go into this user table. Let's see what is it in the user table. So we got the table, right? So as we done with the database, we will do same with the table. We will do hyphen T capital T command and the name of the table will be user. And now we want to know about any columns present inside it. So we will do hyphen hyphen columns, enter it. And yes, you can see there are many columns in that table in the user table. Okay, so you can just check the username of it. So for username, what I will do is in the column section, I will just type hyphen capital C and the you name and I will just dump this uh, result of this. So to dump the result of this, uh, there is a specific command here. Yeah, hyphen hyphen dump all. So what I would do is to hyphen hyphen dump all. Okay, so it has dumped into this location. Okay, so just copy it with Control Shift C, and in this, so it's asking for so give permission also for this. Okay, and here come to this terminal and just go to that location by CD command, copy paste the location okay so we are into that location and here you can see the csv file of it we let's explore the user csv file so i will just use cat command to see the username and here you can see the usernames are pass and one is test okay so we get the username uh, is it the password available in it? No, there is no password. So let uh, just to uh, kill this process and let's explore the password column. So what was the name of the password column? Let let me say it. So it, it is username and in password will be in pass. Okay, so let's say it. Same command instead of a uh, username we have to specify the column name which is pass i want to see the passwords and i will again dump all the uh, content of that column okay so let's see okay that's a great uh, it has uh, like uh, brute force the database and uh, we have got the password which is the username is test and the password is test you can see here actually we got the dump file of it but I can't recognize it before I have just uh, seen this carefully and now we have uh, got the password so let's try in this website go to the sign up option over here and the username is test password is test so I will just type test and here also I will just type test click on login oh yeah so we have cracked into and database and this is how you can crack the database with the help of SQL map so this is how easy it is to use an SQL map. This is just how you, uh, this is as a simple video about and how you can get a database in the vulnerable website. If you want to explore more about an SQL map and you want to wanted me to make some specific video on some specific topic, then you can uh, comment below. I will surely make the video uh, on your request. Thank you so much for watching my video. Hope to see you in next video. Thank you. Dead to me, cause what you said to me Cut so deep and now you're dead to me